all right the complaint here is that it wasn't blowing cold in one room and i can't get in that one room because somebody's in the tub so maybe i'll crawl underneath and or just look see if everything's connected I don't see any exposed ductwork at all. That condenser don't sound very good. Micro channel coal. Ain't got hardly no room for that right there. making that difficult. head pressure like I said we got a micro channel full here you don't look terribly bad let's we'll see about cleaning it
think I'm gonna have to open this up and try to clean it. I get the idea that this is going to be hard to put back together. going through there really easy. I just all right that's enough for getting my probes wet dang look at all of what's coming out of there though Tons of stuff coming out.
I'm still seeing stuff come out on that dish right there. Tons of stuff. Man, that's a lot of the dirt I'm getting out of this. You don't really see it until it hits the wall or something in it. everywhere my head pressure was 370 we're gonna see what it is when I get going That backside was really dirty. After a lot of trouble washing that like three or four times, and then having to put that thing back together and it didn't want to go back together. We're ready to start back up. All right, so my head pressure has not gone above 300. Before it was at 370. Subcooling still looks a little bit high, but we are still drying out. Superheat has come down a little bit. My suction pressure has gone up. I still think we have a little bit of drying to do. All right, I think we're mostly dry now. I still have a high sub cooling right there, 25.7. A little bit high super heat. Maybe there's a little bit of water left on there. But I think that goes to show that these micro channel coils can be sneaky dirty. Like it didn't look that dirty, but when I was blowing through it on over here I could see all the dirt coming out it was just full of dirt so I did that I washed it from the inside out three times and then I washed it from the outside in and uh, it seems to be doing better <laughs> remember that head pressure was 370 now I'm at 320, which is much closer to normal. I I need to either go get them a filter or um, make sure that they go get one. That one was a little bit dirty. Some nice snazzy new valve caps. Well, I hope you enjoyed that little video. Everything turned out fine on that one. Um, I did have to leave her with instructions to buy a new filter, but um, they're happy. They could tell a difference already. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you on the next one.